They're called MyPads, the brainchild of London's Waltham Forest YMCA. These ensuite studio apartments started life as cargo containers, but now converted are kitted out with all necessary mod cons. Uh, cooker, you've got a, a fridge. And it's freezing cold in winter and too hot in summer, which I know from living in corrugated iron huts. So getting it so that it's livable and affordable has taken us three years. Designed to help young people on low incomes, they're now being billed as a possible solution to London's housing crisis. Private rentals in the capital are soaring, up almost 5% year on year, and now stand at an average of 18,000 rand a month. The rent for one of these containers is around 30% of the UK's minimum wage. Now that's about £75 a week, the equivalent to just under 1,200 rand. But not everybody is convinced that this is the solution to London's housing crisis. The Borough Council says while it's monitoring the scheme, it doesn't see this as the way forward. And concerns have been raised that the containers could potentially create a type of ghetto. I fully accept that shipping containers like these are not the long-term solution, but we face a crisis at the moment that's on a parallel with after the Second World War. But what they do provide is an interim solution in a city where extreme wealth and huge poverty live side by side. So for the short term, it's likely more young people will be stepping aboard rather unconventional homes. Natalie Powell, London. News that moves. ENCA.com